Ron starts to wear the Horcrux and um, it just brings out the worst in people and he starts to get very jealous of Hermione and Harry and he thinks there's something going on. Emma, lovely to meet you. You too. You've got the comfy chair. I do have the comfy chair. It's so big that I'm not quite sure where. I... It's not. It's hard to work out know, where to I'm place like... bottom. Uh, yeah. More for I'm, me I'm than for you. I'm on the end, I think. <laughs> so, talk to me. How do yes. you feel about the film now? I mean, li literally, this is the end. It is. What's that feeling like, knowing that the end is imminent? Um, it's obviously really emotional and sad because you know, I'll be leaving a group of people that I essentially grew up with. Um, but on the other hand, I'm excited, you know, to see what the next chapter of my life holds. It's been, it's been 10 years now, so I think, I think we're all ready to move on. It kind of feels like when you're in your last year at school and you're like, oh, it'll be sad to go, but at the same time, like, I'm kind of ready to go. Um, let's talk about the, the, the filming process and the fact that, you know, you, like you say, you've lived this for, for 10 years. Mm. How has that process affected you? Um, I mean, it's hard to even begin to explain how this process affected me because I feel it hasn't just affected me, it's, it's essentially made me who I am. It, it, I started doing it when I was nine years old, so it's something that I've literally grown up with and grown, and grown into. So. I, I couldn't tell you who I would have been if I hadn't, if I hadn't done it. Do you know what I mean? It's that, it's that big. Um, but I mean, I mean, apart from the obvious differences, like I got very famous as a result of the first Harry Potter film. Um, I, I have been acting for the last ten years rather than just being in school. Um, I've been able to travel all over the world promoting promoting the films, and I, um, I've had some pretty incredible experiences as, as a result. So it's. I mean, it's really turned my life upside down. It's, it's been huge, obviously. Did you anticipate that success at any point? Was there a defining moment in any of the Harry Potter films when you realised that, I'm well famous, this, my life is different now? Yeah, um, I, there's been a few surreal moments. Um, you know, I think it was, it was when at premieres, people started yelling, Emma, Emma! But I was like, oh, that's so strange, because they always just used to yell Hermione. They used to know me for that character, and now I'm sort of known for being just me. At the premiere the other night, people yelled Craig, Craig, but it was move Did out of they? the way of Emma. Oh. So I think they were pretty much looking at you. I'm sure that's um, true. There are some incredible <laughs> actors uh, that have joined you guys. I mean, you guys have an established cast, but there's some incredible actors. Oh, gosh. I think that's actually the cool thing about this last one, is that it's not... It isn't really about working with anyone. It's really about the three of us and the three of us being together. It's not about the adult performances holding this film. It's really about our relationship. But um, I mean, probably Helena Bonham Carter again. You know, she's like a real fave of mine. And you had a great scene with Helena yeah, in this I movie. Did. Yeah, I what, did. What's that like when you, you're, you're with possibly one of your idols and mm. you've got that one on one scene? How does that go? Uh, it's intimidating, um, but it's also really fun. And Helena is like a very down to earth, sort of friendly person. Um, so that really helped and we just wanted to make the scene as scary as possible so we had fun collaborating and figuring out how we were gonna how we were gonna do it one more film to go thank you so much it's an absolute you. pleasure to meet thank you thank you so much thank you so talk me through your preparation before you come here the look hair how does how long does this take well i got up late i had a big breakfast with pancakes and uh i time and play some nice music and just try, just try to enjoy every minute of it. I'm only going to do this one more time, so I've got to enjoy it.